good good question. Yeah, back to you now. Like I was I was checking not that long. <laughs> not that long. It's obviously you you start from the swimming. Yeah. Right. When did you start with the swimming? We are. Uh, I came from a little village, and there was not much to do there. Um, yeah. You could do some ball sports like soccer and volleyball or swimming, and we had one of the best swimming squads in the whole country uh, for a little village. So it's quite yeah. impressive. Um, so I started swimming. Um, also because my mom used to swim, so it's yeah. just like you follow your parents. Did, did she was a like competitive swimmer or? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, not until she was really like not long, long. Till right? junior time, uh, or I think still like older age at least. Yeah, she used to swim for one of the bigger squads in the Netherlands. Um, yeah. So I just started to swim, and actually, when I got taught how to swim, I hated it. I yeah. really did not like it. Why? Um, Why was that? I don't know. Maybe just the cold, the water. Like, yeah. did you have cold pool? <laughs> uh, I think. I mean, in the Netherlands, it's not that bad. But you got, you see, I, as a kid, I just hated it. But one of my f- best friends, she uh, liked it. So she said, okay, let's go to the swimming squad. I was like, oh, okay. Uh, so actually, I should be <laughs> thankful to her because otherwise yeah. I wouldn't be here now. Did you tell her? Um, I actually did. Yeah. yeah so nice. it's quite funny. Um, then I actually started enjoying it. Um, but then you get to a certain age where like all the other girls are like quitting or they go and study and they stop doing sports. Yeah. And, yeah. So then I was like, okay, my parents were runners. Uh, I started yeah. to do some running. Is, is your is your dad was yeah. also a runner? Yeah, well, just uh, actually only when they got older, when they wanted to okay. like, get fit. Like get fit. Yeah. I mean, I think my dad has actually done a triathlon when he was young. Uh, oh I really? Think my mum taught kind of taught him how to swim for that race. Oh, um, nice. But then that's that's the only triathlon he has ever done. Like no one in the family has ever done one. <laughs> yeah. Um. So yeah, I just kind of followed my parents' path and just got into swimming. But then I got a bit bored. Uh, I saw the kids' runs. So you've got those, mm. like, the one mile or something. Yeah. And I did that. And then a couple of weeks later, I did one again. And I never trained because yeah. running was so tiring. Yeah, but you, you have, you have so, good fitness from the swimming. Exactly, but it's still different. But after a couple of years, I started to train a bit more because there yeah. was one person from the local newspaper who said, yeah. hey, you have to start running because you're good. And I was like, nah. So one year later, he said, did you already join the club? I was like, no. (laughs) So I started to do that. And then I actually started uh, running a bit more. Uh, But then I met a triad. So you you didn't have any running club to join around your place, just a swimming club? Until I was like 17 or something, I didn't. Oh, wow. So I just... That's, sometimes that's run with my cool. parents then they would take my bike with and i would run 1k and then i would get back they on the bike on the, yeah, just because yeah. it was too tired to just run for yeah. longer than 1k wow yeah that's how i started yeah and then i met a triathlete at the running club where mm. i did and he's like oh you can swim i know you've been swimming because i know you since you were little i was like okay yeah and then uh yeah started doing triathlon because the triathlon federation said, oh, you can do both. And the athletics federation, no, you have to choose. You have to only do athletics because you can't do both. It's like, well, yeah. simple then. I'll go and I, do th- I think that is usually a problem. Like even in my country, like if you start the swimming, they want you just to swim. Yeah, or exactly. if you want to they're run. They're not open for and they, They're not open. Like obviously you see like this kid is really talented yeah. for other sport, yeah, but true. they don't allow no. him to, to cross over. You I know? was definitely not the best one. I only... I think they only needed me for uh, like the relays. If they had like the four by 100, <laughs> they needed another girl. So I was the fourth girl. So yeah, that's, they kind of needed me, but I also was like, well, I want to do something else. I mean, the swimming is nice, but after so many years of just swimming up and down, yeah, it was nice to do something else. Something else. Yeah. yeah. So did you have any, any major success with, with the swimmings or did, no. you know, nationals? I did no. um, nationals, but then only in the relay, like on the yeah. four by one hundred or four by two hundred freestyle. And, and w- what was your event like freestyle or always freestyle? Yeah, always freestyle. Yeah. <laughs> always freestyle. That's, I don't that's think easy I did then. anything else. I remember still that one that the coach tried to teach me how to swim backstroke, okay. and I hated it. Yeah. <laughs> now I actually like it. It's just nice to chill. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but back then I hated it. I did like the um, uh, provincial champs. But then always the long distance, like the 800 and then, 15. then I could get a medal as long as, <laughs> yeah. as, long as it would get longer, yeah. then I would do well. Everyone yeah. would die with the longer yeah, distance. Exactly. And you would, yeah. I don't want to do the 800. I'll do the 800. Do That's my chance. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so it's a good That's thing cool. that happened. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah. So you start with the tri- a triathlon 
with the with the runners and then like when did you first did a triathlon and maybe you see like okay I can I can my follow first, this yeah. this sport more. My first race was I think in two thousand eight when I did um, a triathlon in France in Forbach. The funny thing is that um, I actually the federation had qualification criteria and you only had to swim eight hundred meters and run mm-hmm. like a three k on the track, and um, I qualified for European Champs Juniors. Oh, straight but, away, but straight I'd away. But I've never done a triathlon before. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so yeah. some of the parents of the other kids were quite angry because they're like, how can yeah. you send a girl who has never even done a triathlon before? Oh, wow. <laughs> so they were like, uh, let's bring you to France the week before because you should probably do a race before you go to it was, uh, European. Well, it was in Avignon or something. Uh, Lisbon, was it? Oh, it was yeah, Lisbon. Lisbon. I think it was yeah. mine, mine first. Also. Or I think yeah. the year before. So I was that time only swimmer, yeah. and because I did summer cutlon just for fun, yeah. in summer, you know, and they were like, "Oh, you might be really uh, talented." So, yeah. so I Same, would go, story. but I didn't know cycling or yeah. you know, and they would smash me. They I would think, smash me. yeah, the the race and I was, was like, was your oh. first one open water? Because I had never swim open water. I thought it was really scary. <laughs> I, I wasn't scared. It's just like the wetsuit was small and oh, like. Yeah the the fighting everything I I on the start I was like this sport is not good for me yeah did I did you feel the same, the same? Yeah. I was the race I did the, the, first race. The, one, the race before European champs just a week before I think uh week, one or two weeks before good and training it was race. yeah <laughs> and it was, in, it was in a pool so yeah. I was used as a swimmer used yeah. to having the whole end by herself but now there's yeah. suddenly like six girls just oh. going in and I just found it horrible. Yeah. <laughs> and I was just like, every tumble toe, you know that they don't swim in circles, but they just try to go. So every yeah, yeah, tumble toe, yeah. you have to dive underneath. Oh, really? I thought it was horrible. And then I got onto my bike, but I had my bike shoes next to it because I'd mm. never done it before. And I tried to like go on the bike. I did the same on the I, first Europeans. I ran into, I <laughs> dro- rode into a fence and it was just, <laughs> yeah. and I got side stitches. And after that race, I was like, oh, I did not like this at all. But yeah, next week I'm going to Lisbon, so I'm. Yeah, and how how to... was the Lisbon experience? Was it any better? A little better? bit better, but yeah. it was my first time ever to the open water. Okay. <laughs> I mean, on a holiday as a kid, you swim in a yeah, lake or yeah, something. Yeah, yeah, just for but, fun. Yeah. And then just before the start, there was a fish. I was like, oh no. <laughs> oh, this is scary. <laughs> this is not... I think I even, like, the first stroke might have even been breaststroke. I don't remember. I think the funniest, my old coach will remember that there was a crash on the bike. Yeah. And I asked if I had to stop or if I had to keep going. <laughs> so that's how I knew Did I was in the sport. Or no, I didn't. They crashed for everyone else. Oh, okay. And I was like, do I have to stop and help them? Yeah, yeah. That's so, funny. Yeah. That's funny. That, that's how it started. Yeah. That is cool. Serious, but think, not serious. The thing I noticed is like people from well, Europeans, like how they get so much international exposure so early. Yeah. yeah. And in South yeah, Africa, it's like yeah. you're racing against 10 guys or eight guys. Yeah, and until you get the opportunity, like up. okay, maybe we'll fly to Europe too. Yeah, and to, that's pretty yeah. far away. And that's really far and quite and then expensive. Your parents so. have to go yeah. with you, and because yeah. you can't go by yourself, yeah, you're we drove to and, France. So that's yeah, probably why days. when most people, I mean, were racing in South Africa, would race against each other, and then that's the yeah. competition. Yeah. So we we are quite lucky because we have lots of competition close by, really close. Yeah, I mean, you can other, drive yeah. to. And also probably you, you didn't know like how good you are till till you go out of yeah, yeah like, we get to throw them into yeah. them just yeah. see yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. that's interesting and see race and then it's like oh no yeah I'm like I was the big fish and all of a sudden I'm the small fish <laughs> oh you <laughs> yeah. you wasn't small fish. Because